Hello, hello, hello everyone and welcome back to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming. Thank you so much for joining me today in Mini Metro. That's right, we're back in the metro system, we're back in the subways. Let's see what type of damage we can do today. So far we have ruined London, we have destroyed the City of Light Paris, but now we get to come to the States and screw up New York City. Never actually been to New York City myself, but that's okay because we'll be going to Chicago next, my hometown. So re really excited about that. So let's go ahead and see what we can do with the Big Apple, see if we can do some damage to the city that never sleeps. All right, so we're going to start with our red line here. If you guys haven't watched any of Mini Metro before, it's a great game. We were designing a metro system for the entire city. So these circles can spawn or these uh, stations can spawn. And then uh, little guys will spawn as well. And then you got to get them from here to wherever they want. So the square wants to go to square, triangle wants to go to the triangle, and so on. Uh, and wow, there's a lot of circles spawning, but that's okay. So let's go ahead and do, we'll just do the green line like that. Now, as things keep going, it will get faster and more hectic. And our goal is to not lose or let a station get overpopulated. Ooh, let's go ahead and pause here. And I'm thinking maybe we do... Uh, let's do a line like this, dude, to there, and then I'm going to bring the red line back, and we're going to just do the red line like that, and then the green line we'll leave like that. All right, so you don't want the station to get too full. If it gets full, we fail, so our goal is to not allow that to happen. Oops, and that's not connected, so green, you're going to go down there and grab that. Perfect. Uh, ooh, and now we have to cross. Now we have bridges here. You can see on the bottom right, we've got one bridge. So let's go ahead and bring green back one and then put green there. Now that's all triangles. So maybe we bring green over there and it can take all those triangles there. Let's see, we've got that triangle out there. So let's go ahead and unattach red and we're gonna bring red over there. Now every week you get to choose or you get a locomotive and then you can choose between bridges, carriage, stations, lines, things like that. So seeing as we are already down two bridges, let's go ahead and grab two more bridges to make sure if we need to like get to this island or something like that, we're able to do that without failing. All right, there's a circle out there. So maybe we go ahead and bring purple line. Nope, purple line's still gonna go through there. We'll bring the purple line all the way out there. So you don't want it to have too much overlap, but it seems like the game is forcing us to do that. So what do I mean by overlap? We've got one, two, three circles in a row. So heaven forbid we get a triangle here. We're not dropping that triangle all the way till here. So you don't want to do that too much. Um, okay, let's go ahead and bring red line down to that circle. We've got an extra train. We might put it on, let's go ahead and put it on the green line. That way we can keep these passengers moving. So I'd really like to see some more alternating, but like right here, that's going to stay circle, circle, circle. Can't do anything about that right now. Hopefully we get some different spawns. Like, okay, here we go. We got a square down here. So let's just go ahead and have green hit that square. Uh, it is a longer line, but that's okay. We got two trains running it. So I feel a little bit better about that. Ah, here comes our first non-circle, square, or triangle. So purple line, you're going to go ahead and grab that for us. And we're already done with week three, and we've got two bridges. Let's go ahead and grab another line. Uh, 118 people move, so obviously the more people we move, the better. I think when I played it the first time, I got something like, uh, what I get? Um, something like 1,400 people, so we'll, we'll have to see. What we're going to do is we're going to bring our red line there, and it's going to grab that. Got a triangle out here, perfect, that's what we need. So now when the green train comes this way, it can pick up any triangles, drop them off, spin around and then come back that way. Uh, red is doing a couple triangles in a row. Okay, good, now we're gonna break that up. We're gonna drop that there. So red is getting a little long, so let's go ahead and drop another locomotive on red. And that will alleviate some of that congestion. Now what we could do is make this a big loop and like let's say bring red across this way, hit this triangle circle and bring it back to that square. I don't think we're going to do that. Hmm. Um, we'll leave the circle. Let's see what we get at the end of the week. If we can get another line, maybe we do something like the teardrop to the circle, to the square, or like have it come this way. I don't know. We'll find out. Yeah, I know. Uh, all right. We're going to go ahead and grab that circle off the red line. All right. Locomotive, carriage. All right. So let's just go ahead and bring the purple line here. We'll do that. Purple line's getting kind of long. We'll drop that there. Um, or do I take a train off? Hmm. All right, for now, we're just going to have the red line extend up 
and eventually I'll get that on a separate line. Now, if we were playing in the hardcore, mo yeah, hardcore mode, we wouldn't be able to change our lines like we are. Once they're in place, they're in place. It's so like when that pentagon uh, spawned, we can't just drag the red line there. We'd have to like come up all the way over. Um, okay, we're gonna craft that with the red line like that. Let's go ahead and put a carriage on one of these red trains. Just to, again, aid with some of that congestion. All right, almost another week down. A triangle down here. Hmm. Um, I could drop the green line like that. Let's do that for now. And we'll see what that looks like. Yeah, that looks pretty good. This purple line's kind of short. So if we got something that spawns over here or down here, we'll drag the purple to that. Ah, okay, that's square. So let's go ahead and bring the purple line to there. And then maybe we hit the locomotive. Let's go ahead and get that. Ah, the interchange, perfect. So if a station gets too full, like this circle here was getting, we can make an interchange, which allows more passengers to sit on it before the timer goes off. Getting a little congested on the red line again. Um, let's just drop another train in there, get that running. It'll start to pick up some more people. This station was getting a little congested. Okay, he's gonna pick up a lot of those circles. Ooh, and there's a circle here. Um, hmm. Mm -hmm -hmm. Maybe let's let's get another train here, and then we'll do a line like here to here. Uh, and at least just start covering that and maybe have it run all the way up there All right, we're doing okay 500 people so far. Yeah, we'll bring another line in this way Yeah, I know you're getting full. That's okay. We'll get to you here soon. It's Friday night Friday afternoon We'll clean it up in a minute. Ooh, that's filling up pretty quickly though mm, We'll keep an eye on that. Hopefully we don't have to drop an interchange on that. It's Saturday afternoon. We're almost done with the week Let's see how we do here Let's just go ahead and build our line now, and then all I have to do is drop a train on it. All right, that, and then um, locomotive and carriage. And we'll go ahead and drop a locomotive and a carriage on the blue line. Nope, on the blue line, there we go. And then part of me wonders, do I, I think we leave, yeah, let's leave that. And then we're going to take, take the purple line and bring it out like that, yeah. And then I wonder if maybe we go here, here, and then let's do that. We're gonna go here. Oh, we don't have any more bridges though, okay. Maybe we won't be doing that. Let's take it to this triangle because that's starting to build up quite a bit. All right, let's do that. All right, he's gonna pick up a lot of things. We're at 610 people, hopefully we're doing well. That cleaned up that line a little bit. Now with less people here, purple should be able to hopefully start bypassing some of these stations and it'll start to help with this triangle. Purple is getting pretty condensed and pretty long. It's got one, two, two trains on it. Um, we got an interchange that we can use in a second. We're gonna bring red up to there. We're at almost 700 people. All right, blue line bringing people there. The diamonds, where's the diamond at? Pentagon, that square is probably gonna be made into an interchange here soon. Oh, the diamond's right there, okay. So purple can drop off a bunch of diamonds there. Pick up that square, that station's getting pretty condensed as well. Um, I wonder if we should bring, let's bring green over there, get a little overlap. Yeah, I know, I know. Okay, let's, we'll bring green out there. All right, so do we go, oof, okay, we got triangle up there. Okay, we're gonna back, back that up and then bring that up like that. Locomotive, please, and a line. All right, let's do... All right, we got a lot of triangles we need to get to. Let's do this. Um, how do I want to do this? Maybe we do... Let's do something like this. Let's go here to here to here to here. Now, where's a, is there a square on this side? No, we don't have any bridges. Um to here. I know that's kind of weird, but let's just do that, see if that alleviates some of the congestion. Uh, we'll probably be deleting this line here soon. We'll do something like that, so it kind of zigzags through there. All right, that's caught up. 875 people, plus we still got this interchange to use. We are cruising light or wrong. Yeah, right along. Cannot speak very well English. All right, blue line, you're gonna pick up that circle. Perfect, pick up those guys, take them all there. Uh, how we doing? Red line's getting a little congested, but it's got three trains on it, so it seems to be handling well. And we've got a actual diamond down here. 
Um, I guess let's bring green and purple there. There we go. Help with that. All right, he's gonna go there. All right, we're doing okay. Over a thousand people, can't complain so far. Can't complain at all. We're gonna pick up a bunch of folks there. Yep, go there. That station's starting to get angry. We got a couple stations angry at us. This blue one's starting to get angry. Let's keep an eye on that. Um, okay, green line, you're gonna hit that star as well. All right, is he gonna be able to pick anything up? He might have to blow past that. Uh, we'll take the second interchange. Let's see how this does. No, okay, let's go ahead and drop an interchange on that to cool that jet. And then we got these three here. Let's see, is this red gonna pick up anything? Picked up a few things. We're at 1,600, or excuse me, 1,100, almost 2,000. Let's pause and we'll drop our interchange there. Um, okay, picked up some folks. That circle out there is not doing us any favors. I know, I know. Oh, we got an extra train. Let's get it running on... I guess the green line, have it go that way. Hit that station, hopefully calm it down. Okay, that's good. That one's starting to get angry. Uh-oh, um, all right, let's do, I guess, that. This is not the greatest uh, metro design, but that's okay, that's okay. That one's getting angry, that one's getting angry, but that, there we go, that double carriage car there is gonna help us out. We'll do that, and then we'll bring our orange line there. All right, you're calming down, good. 1,300 people, angry, that one's angry. Hopefully, where's the purple train? Purple train's coming, but is it gonna get there in time? It's gonna be close, is it gonna pick anyone up? Okay, it seems to have stopped for now. Nope, it's gonna go, we're gonna lose right here. Ah, well, we have ruined New York City. We moved uh, 1,442 people. That's a pretty good number, not great, but pretty good. So if you've enjoyed Mini Metro, let me know in the comments down below. Don't forget to like that video, this video. If you want to see more, this is a pretty easy game. I shouldn't say easy. Easy to learn, hard to master. I mean, there's people moving two, three, four thousand 4,000 people on some of these maps, and I'm only getting 1,400. So I've got some work for me to do. But we're going to Chicago next, my hometown more or less, so I am very excited. So if you want to see me play Chicago, don't forget to subscribe to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming so you get all this great content on time and in orderly fashion. Thank you so much for coming today, and we'll see you in the next Mini Metro video.